West Lafayette has a total of 13.81 square miles, which is roughly about 35.77 square kilometers. Purdue has 2,468 2, acres. To basically sum up what those numbers mean is that you can easily walk around Purdue, but you can't easily walk around town. You need some form of transport to get around. Walking around Purdue, I see many students using all forms of transport to get, get to their classes or to get back to their houses. Lots of people use bikes as there are many bike lanes around Purdue and even going into West Lafayette. The only problem about having a bike is that if you don't lock it up properly, you'll find your bike with no wheels or in a tree, like this picture I took. I've also seen a lot of people use skateboards and electric skateboards, but with saying that, I've also seen a lot of people fall off their skateboards or crash into people walking by. A lot of students also use the buses as they are free for students and come every 15 minutes. They go all around campus and some go into town. They're reliable and run for 24 hours a day, seven days a week. One thing that I just found out is that from an article from My Money Purdue, which was released in August 2019, which new students I think would be really interested in, is that Purdue has partnered with Zipcar, which is a way to provide students who don't have their car on, cars on campus with a rental at a reasonably price. There are about six, six different locations on campus where you can rent a zip car. The insurance and gas is included in the rental, so you just have to pay a flat rate just to take care of it. There's also a rent a bike which costs $10 a semester, and they are just simple, plain, no gear bikes. One way that I found the easiest of going to places that were just a bit far from campus like Target, is by using Uber or Lyft. I'll show you a map so that you can see how far away it is from campus. As you can see on the map, it is not impossible to use the buses, but it does take 46 to 48 minutes. And you do have to take two buses to get there. And the, camp the buses off campus are not as reliable. You then have to walk some of the way and weather in Indiana is very unpredictable. Biking takes about 26 minutes, but you are going shopping, so where will your groceries go? There is also no bike parking at Target, so it's not the best way. So I use Uber or Lyft to go to Target, as it only takes 11 minutes, and it's only about $13 both ways. They also help me when I'm done shopping, but there should also be a Target opening on campus soon in 2020, so you wouldn't have to worry about going to, the, to this Target. So to sum up everything that I have said, there are numerous and cheap ways of getting around town, and Purdue and West Lafayette are very safe in every kind of way with public transport or private transport. I think the last thing I have to say is boiler up and hammer down.